I must fight for reproductive rights as hard as I fight for immigration, as hard as I fight for economic justice, as hard as I fight against white supremacy, as hard as I fight against homophobia. When I take a moment to stop and think, I know these issues are all connected to mine. My issues are your issues. Your issues are mine. We must know this, and we must live it. Today can be a new day only if we choose it to be. As we look forward, I want us all to challenge ourselves and each other, challenge our collective humanity. It is time to recapture the spirit of ourselves of 50 years ago, to rediscover the best of who we are and embrace it. The core of ourselves is not a racist, homophobic person, a sexist or bigot, but at our core, we are decent human beings that believe we all deserve the right to live honestly and completely as our full selves. Dr. King said, the moral arc of the universe always bends towards justice. But what I know is that sometimes we have to push. In the words of Curtis Mayfield, now maybe someday I'll reach that higher goal. I know that I can make it with just a little bit of soul. Because I've got my strength, and it don't make sense not to keep on pushing. So I'm saying to you, keep on pushing. While we are pushing, I call on each and every one of us to challenge ourselves, to challenge our thinking, challenge our motives, our actions. Today, I ask you to say yes to the challenge we must meet in our struggle for social and economic justice. When I ask you to take up these challenges, I want to hear you answer loud and clear with, yes, I will. Will you challenge white supremacy? Yes, I will. Will you challenge misogyny? Yes, I will. Will you challenge transphobia? Yes, I will. Will you challenge xenophobia? Yes, I will. Will you challenge homophobia? Yes, I will. Leave here today with this, examining the words you use, questioning the thoughts you think with total and complete faith and the human being you aspire to be. Leave here today with purpose in your heart, and tomorrow will indeed be a new day.